Hello! I am so happy to bring you Barbie Sugar's Daddy Ken doll. I just received it today as I am filming. This will be released on Monday, but I'm so excited to share it with you. Um, I missed out on the first exclusive from the movie, the Ken in the disco jumpsuit, and still hope to get him one day, but I am so glad that I got him. So many people didn't, and like, my sympathies go out to you, so, um, I'm going to share what he looks like and give my honest opinion. So, uh, let's get into him. All right, are you ready? I got the top opened. I mean, there's gonna be tissue paper, but what? There's the box. Ready, 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 ready. I think he looks cuter in person. Oh my goodness, you're all blurry. I'm so sorry. Okay. I really do think he looks cuter in person. Oh my goodness, like, the pictures just didn't do him justice. Like... He is such a cutie. Totally. And then there's his little doggy, Sugar. I am really, really digging the details. Oh my goodness. Okay. So I'm going to take the tissue paper off and you can get a closer look then. Okay. So here he is in his box and, um, just an FYI, I won't be taking him out of his box. Although I am super tempted because I'm looking at the details and I'm like, oh my goodness. Like, I love his face and his shirt is looking very cool and detailed, very good polo. And I love the details in his jacket, little pockets. The actual, they actually kind of look like they would be functional. A little flap there, that one I don't think would be. His pants have details to them where the seams are. I, I forget what they're called, but they're really, really nicely detailed. Down in the box you can see his shoes, and they're just a basic white um, boat shoe, it kind of looks like. Um, and then of course you have you have um, Sugar, the cute little white Yorkie, and she has a pink leash and a little bow. She has like a little... Sorry about the glare. Um, she has a little bow... Bone. My bad. A silver bone tag on her collar. But yeah, like... His face is just like really nice and I like the way that he's like that he's I just he's a little tanner and he looks really good and yeah I mean he's got a white base stand and uh typical Barbie the movie box this is this new I have not gotten a whole lot of these um this this little heart design seems to be new. Um, let me know. Let me know down in the comments if if any of the other boxes had this. I don't have very many right now. Um, I'm still working on getting more. I have a whole bunch pre-ordered. Um, I keep finding them at retail price, or I did find one just slightly below. Saved me on taxes, and um, I had free shipping on her. But like I said, they're all pre-ordered. Um, but yeah, let me know if any of the other ones have had this bee on the front. It's really cute. I love the glittery look to it. I have really been digging these dolls. Okay, so Barbie, the movie at the bottom. We've got the side here. The 
typical back of the box. Greetings from Barbie Land, wishing you the best day ever. Oh, I just enjoyed this movie. Some things, maybe not, but the overall, I liked it. I just wouldn't take very young kids. And I have young kids, so. I, I'm, that's my opinion, though, but. I love him, not taking him out of box, but, oh my goodness. Here. Sorry, my camera is acting up today. I'm having to manually focus it. Um, uh, it's one of those things. With my birthday coming up and everything, I'm hoping to get some new batteries for it. I really like my camera. I just... Maybe not the best thing for doing all the filming that I've been doing. Um, my batteries, too, need replaced. So. Um, but yes, I, I really like him a lot. I am so glad that I was able to get him. He is definitely one of my favorites. And, oh my goodness, ugh, they're all sold out. I'm sorry for any of you who did miss out on him. Be patient, as I have been as well. And you will find dolls from the movie at the prices they retail for or slightly under. I, I completely, completely understand how you're feeling. Trust me when I say that. I have missed so many cool dolls this year. And I'm... Ugh. I'm definitely having FOMO here lately and feeling depressed with missing all these really cool dolls dolls that have come out and yeah so hang in there hang in there I feel ya like I know how it, how it how it feels and and just thank you for watching my video I recommend him if you can find him definitely just be patient don't buy the outrageous prices that people on eBay are going to sell them for, if not already. I'm sure they are already. And just just hold on, okay? Um, one, one day. Like, I missed that other Mattel exclusive, Ken, and I still have other ones that I can't find. Like, the other, like, Disco Barbie and um, Western Ken and... What's the other one that released the first? Um, oh, um, the Barbie in the pink and blue plaid checker, whatever you want to call it with the hat, that I really like that, wanted to get two of her even, I just can't find her, so, but I'm being, trying to be patient, and there's a whole bunch of the other ones too, so hang in there, and Thank you, thank you so much for watching my video, my review. Sorry I couldn't show you him unboxed, but I most definitely am trying not to clutter up my little tiny art room slash doll room and hope to have a video of it all organized. I finally have gotten started getting it anyway. Um, organized, and I've got a lot of my dolls displayed, maybe about half of them, I, oh my goodness, I realized I have a lot more dolls than I thought I did, so I need like a room twice this size, which, just for displaying, um, I've been really trying to limit myself, but it's hard when there's so many good ones out there coming out and have already been released too, yeah. Please check out my Instagram, my whatnot, Jennifer Louise Dolls for the whatnot. I've got anything leaving my collection I'm trying to list there. I am planning on doing some more shows, live shows, auctions. Um, so just keep an eye out and hopefully I can do one. There are a lot to do sometimes and with my, my kid going to school this year, it was just a lot to do deal with here all at once, and I've got a lot of other things too, but definitely go check out Whatnot, Jennifer Louise Dolls, also Instagram, Handmade by Jennifer Louise, and don't forget to check out my Patreon account, 
I have a lot of, well, I've been trying to do some art and, yeah, art videos over there mostly, but I do early access videos a lot of the time. This guy, he's going to be over there, but he won't be early access. He will just be public, so um, you won't have to pay to watch the video over there either. It'll just be available. Um, not sure exactly how that works. I haven't messed around enough with Patreon yet, so, um, but I know you're not going to have to pay for it. I think you just follow me and you can watch the video. And I have a lot more over there, too, that are all public and you don't have to buy. You can just follow me, so definitely check it out. That is Jennifer Louise, and just look for my logo. That should be right here in the corner. Um, the one for YouTube, the Jennifer Louise with the JL in the middle, and the Clovers. Um, that is my logo, and nobody else's. I made that one. Um, but yes, thank you for your time. I hope you have a great day. Bye.